KFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, first day of May and we've got quite a sell-off. Started off uh, last night, continuing uh, yesterday actually, and then it's continuing through the night and into this morning. We're kind of at the lows, we're down 585 points in the Dow, 23,760. One of the reasons why I was warning subscribers to my opening call, my daily newsletter, oh, this is Basil Chapman. This is the Tiger Financial News Network noontime update. Sorry about that. Just such a busy day here that I forgot about that. Um, yeah, so what we're looking at here is that uh, within the context of the peaks and troughs that we look at in the Chapman Wave methodology, peak F is often where we see quite a sharp sell-off. And in this particular case, this looks to me like it's going to turn into a peak F if we remain either close to these lows or by Monday, we're starting to go a little bit lower than where we are right now, 23,738. And more importantly, I also said that the MACD is still very strong. Stochastic still good. It's at 80%. It's come down quite a bit. On balance volumes turned down. So we were expecting for the last couple of days that we're getting to a topping motion and that there's a really good chance that we're going to uh, at least take the first week of May to digest some of these spectacular gains. We spoke about the moving averages. Look at this, the S&P. SPX.X, there we are. S&P hits exactly the 200 period moving average. When was it last there? It was last there on the 5th of uh, March. Slumped right through it. Well, the day before, next day, it used that and broke below it. And uh, hasn't been even close. It went all the way down to 2191.86. Uh, hits uh, the high of three days ago, four day, three days ago of uh, 29.54.86, and now we're at 28.26.96. This is a big pullback, and we're testing right now the 14-period moving average. MACD is still good. Stochastic's good at 81%, turning down on balance volumes, turning down so is relative strength. But technically, the weekly charts are still, um, they've got quite a bit of oomph left. Uh, QQQ, uh, also peak F here. Down 6.30 at 21, 212.60. Uh, also a peak F potential right here. Uh, we've got 20, uh, we're at 20, 212, 211 is the uh, support. IWM, which had much bigger moves, is now having a bigger move to the downside at 123.59. And then we'll talk about gold just as we're about to break. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. Uh, you'll see it on the front page of TFNN. And I hope you have a wonderful weekend, but I also hope you stay for my Tiger Technician's Hour coming up right as this program 